Alrighty. Hey, what's up, Mark? How you doing? Um, yeah, this is that uh, Woods, the Wood Brothers, the luckiest man. Um, we've got the capo on the first fret. Um, so everything is accordingly. So instead of calling it the first fret or second fret, it's actually the first fret. So chords are um, C sharp to a G sharp. Um, a to an E or A to an E. So um, if we if the capo wasn't on there with the capo off, <clears throat> it becomes a D minor, A, A sharp to an F. But um, and it's really technically the same chords, but just for sake of having the capo on, we'll call this a C sharp, G sharp, A to E. And that is um, the basic uh, verse there. And I think the strum he's using is just a down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 or A. So that C sharp minor, um, first finger across the fourth fret, second finger on the fifth fret, third, fourth, on the sixth. Um, yeah. Actually, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. So, and then everything is going to move up one. A to an E. If you don't have the capo on, you're going to have to do bar chords. It would be nice to do bar chords. It's just an easy shape. So, and that's with having another verse during there. Going into the next section, he plays a G sharp seven, which looks like this. Oh, oh sorry, it starts with an F sharp seventh, which first finger across all the strings, second finger on the G string on the third, on the fourth for the third finger on the A string. There's an A, uh, F sharp seven chord. And then he does this, which goes, Which is a G sh um hold on. Yeah. He does this little figure. You could leave your finger there if you want, but he's really just hitting the bottom four strings. So it's a just a G sharp seven chord. First finger across the third, second finger on the fourth. Um, you could throw your third finger on the fifth of the A string. And after that part, it's just an A. And then A to an E. So that's pretty much the chords. Cool, cool song. And that's probably it. I won't go over more in lessons, but that's the chords. Um, so I'll text you a picture of the uh, chord changes. Actually, I also wrote it out without the capo too. Um, D minor, A, A sharp, F. And then that other part would be, um, yeah, B flat. Um, there's a G. But with the capo on, it's R. It's a little bit different. So, capo on the first fret, it's as I said before. Starts off with F sharp. Cool. All right. Have a good day. Uh, hopefully this is helpful. Catch you later. Bye.